po. Uh, I'm very happy and grateful na meron po akong new artist to uh, kapaso uh, the presence of uh, Sir Andrugan, Mike, 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 Growing family ang aking lineage and uh, uh, welcome, welcome sa Tyrone Escalante Artist. For the three artists, may mga pinagalingan na rin kayo management before, hindi naman the first time, you know? So ano ngayon yung gagawin nyo at maipapangako na kay Tyrone for the team management now? <laughs> Start. 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 Uh, but, oh, but I'm going after project. What's next? So, same to me and go. Same to me and go to the end. So, we do have a project to get the end. Commitment and champagne. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, being with uh, Tyrone, I, I promise to be the best for the Ravales I can be. Thank you. So first, I just want to thank Piatai because I came from a, um, a different management before. Actually, hindi pa kami nag-usap kasi galing akong makulod. Pero uh, what I can promise him is I'm not here just as, as an artist. Na. I'm also here to help him. I'll also help him in marketing also myself because, of course, it has to be 50-50 um, in terms of um, effort and work and in terms of marketing also and management but also we artists will do the same as well. So that's why before kasi nakikita na nakikita kami lagi, we started seeing each other in our times na yun. And then nakikita ko na lang siya kung may mga artists siya na nagigest on ours. It's a show and then we just say hi to Pero um, now I really took the time to approach him and ask for his help na talagang may tayo if there's no community or whatsoever. Especially after the pandemic. Um, talagang nagulat ako na binigyan niya ako ng chance na to. So I'm very grateful for you tayo for this opportunity. And I saw also how aggressive you are in terms of um, your goals, mga artists mo, and sa management mo. And I wish you also success, and I wish us success also sa mga future endeavors natin. Ang haba. Thank you, Tita. <laughs> okay. Thank you for the question. Siyempre, huwag na naman actually ako hinihiling sa kanya eh. More on, uh, parang, more on, uh, parang itulungan niya lang ako. And I also told him that if there are mga inquiries sa akin, I'll also pass it to him. Kasi ako personally, I also uh, closed so many deals na sa akin din ito kalapit. Even endorsement with the post, um, hotel, uh, what's this, hotels, yung mga dumalapit ngayon in terms of social media platform. Which is yung yung gusto ko, i-boost yung social media ko talaga. And I can see also yung potential of ever kasi willing naman na dumag-post. Um, whatever hindi kami into acting, but yeah, so um, alam naman ni Kuya Tai siguro, and I mean, saksi na naman siya sa talents ko, even in the form of these fantastic. Very familiar ako yun siya, and kasi naging love tip siya ni Akihiro. Yes, yes. Sobrang tagal ko na sa kapila. Yun yung mga nag-start pa lang ako, so Ah, uh, sa pag-start ko para dapat tulong ako din yung mga kasamay ng artista ko na tulong ako sa kayo. Sorry. Um, seryoso yun, sabi ko bigyan mo ako ng, bigyan mo ako ng projects na nagpwede kong ipakita ko ng 
kung ano yung mga improvements na nagawa ko para sa sarili ko. And uh, I think si Tayo yung mga kagawagan para sa akin. And um, kaya si intervention niya, pagpunta ko sa kanya dahil hindi ko siya kaya personally. Pero may, pero no akong committee one time, uh, she's a director from ABS. Kaibigan ko siya kasi dati siya assistant director ni Joyce Bernal. So nagkukwento kami, nagkukwento ko na kami, parang nag-meet kami one time. Tapos uh, nagkwento ko siya sa kanya na uh, parang may load na for, uh, for a new manager na na talaga mag-push sa akin, talaga maniniwala sa akin sa pagkayahan ko. Eh, bigla siyang nag- Bigla siya ng naming up. Sabi niya, si, sa, sa vision ko daw, sa actor sa ngayon, sabi niya, ang baka gawa daw nun sa akin, isip ay ko. That's why, um, that night, after, ano nga, gumabag yung ano eh. Gumabag yun nun. Um, Nananiti kami dito sa may, ano, sa may, ito, sa star area. Uh, pero mo yung meeting na yun is, Matagal na kami dapat mag-uwi kong director na yun, pero doon na kami nag-loop that time. Siguro mga 6 months yan in the making yun. So, good. We got some intervention yan. That's why, after yung, after yung makipagkwento to the director yan, um, tinawagan ko na siya, si, si Taro, and uh, nag-usap pa kami. So, sabi ko, baka, baka ito yung sign na yun. And uh, I was also with my film saying that time, and siya din, parang iba yung feeling niya nung tayo na yun at yung sinabi sa akin si Tayo yung mga kagawayan. Um, yun. So, talagang, ano, talagang feeling ko, guys, in their bedroom. Sa amin naman po, ang same, same vision na yun. Ay, ating siya nagpo, like, before kasi si Kaya tayo nakikita ko na siya. Tagal, tagal na yung pagkakilala. Pero may kalong may chance na siya mag-handle sa akin. Actually, yung lagi ko ng request ko yun, David. Ano ko lang is magtulungan kami sa like 50-50 effort. Kasi team, ano to yung team effort? Hindi naman worried if it's kuya Tayla or kami lang ang pista niya. So, kailangan tulungan and dedication din kami lang. And same with ano, kuya Polo. Same with kuya Polo na before din ako nag-sign up ni kuya Tayla, may nagsasabi din sa akin na nag-a-jerimate din. Kasi hindi na lang ako na kaibigan ko rin. Yun, and sabi rin nag-name drop din siya kay Kuya Tayo rin daw. Kasi Kuya Tayo kasi is very, I mean, very hands-on. Like yung sabi ko yun, like, do know where I do how. So, like ako. And yun, lagi looking forward po to grow. So, Ako, anong nakikita ko special sa kanila? Uh, yun niya, uh, si Chanel nakita ko na talaga na very talented during the 30 sa akin. So, alam ko na meron pa sa akin na ibubuga dito sa interest natin. Same with Polo, uh, alam naman natin na matagal na si Polo sa interest niya. Pero, same kami ng goal. Gusto kong magpapakita pa kung ano yung meron kay Polo. Kasi, uh, parang sa ngayon na nasa gitna si Polo yun. Kailangan namin ng kick para mas mapatunayan na, na mas may kumbuga pa si Polo when it comes to acting. Si Andrew, you know naman na uh, galing siya sa iba't ibang management, gusto kong i-prove din kay Andrew kung ano yung pwede kong pipigay. Ang nakita kong qualities na, na meron sila, eh, yun yung isang kung bato sila tinanggap. Kasi kailangan tinanggap ko sila dahil naniniwala ako sa kanila. Yun, ganun lang kasi yun eh. Hindi dahil sa quality. So, uh, uh, ako po, <laughs> eh, ako po, masasagot uh, kaya ang great experience. Uh, kasi yung previous management for this film din, uh, puro big stars din habang nila. So, para sa akin, at end of the day, uh, it depends pa rin eh, kung, kung paano ka ipipush, kung paano ka ikaday, kung paano ka buhol mahin na isang manager mo for you to grow. So, para sa akin, oh, may advantage na kay Jane Dillon, pero at the end of the day, kung dalawin ko yun, ay hindi. Yung nagkakitindihan and yung nagkakas. So, of course, of course, um, isa yun sa mga factor kung bakit uh, uh, pinigil ko si, si Tarlon. And, uh, 
alam ko kasi yung story ni G, somehow, alam ko yung story niya. Yes. And uh, alam ko si Tyrone yung tipo ng tao hindi kayo iniwan. You know? Um, and mahalaga sa akin yun. Um, I'm sure na marami sila pinagdaan ni G. So, so right. they, they started from, from bottom hanggang sa, sa top, di ba? So, um, nakita ko yung, nakita ko yung sobrang, sobrang dedicated ni Tyrone. And, uh, Nakita ko talaga kung paano siya mag-alaga sa mga, sa mga talent niya. Talagang uh, pag-protectahan niya, uh, ipag-alaban niya. Tsaka talagang alam kong uh, pinaniniwalaan niya ng, ng talagang sa abot ng kanyang mga kaya. And uh, yun, yun ang yun kaka, isa sa mga gusto ko na quality ng talent. Just to be honest, of course it's an advantage for us na meron siyang booster of talents na a very visible na yun in terms of uh, sa mga projects, TVs, diba? So, advantage yun for us. But, it will always depend naman sa amin kung ano yung may offer namin um, to his, his management. And I also believe when I first um, uh, spoke to him that he was very humble and um, very approachable na alam kong alam ko, this is, uh, ito yung time, actually I have also personal reasons Pero ito yung time na kailangan ko talaga someone that will help and support me and you know, that will help me also grow as a person. And nakita ko yun sa kanya na wala siyang ere kausap, talagang kung totoo ka, totoo din siya. So that's what I appreciate about him and I can see that if he maintains that attitude towards his talents and towards his work. So kami rin, nakakawa rin kami doon and at the same time, maybe magtutulungan kami mag-grow at lumaki pa itong management. So, yun. Thank you. Gusto ako, let's try hard lang talaga. Mag-a very start ang buhay ko talaga. Tsaka yung objectives ko. Yun yan. Hard work. Tsaka, kailangan lang maging aggressive, maging consistent sa ginagawa. Yun lang yun. Tsaka, hindi ako nag-burn talaga ng bridges. So, lahat ng mga nakakatrabaho ko. Executives, uh, mga boss, lahat yan from utility up to pinakamataas. Talagang up to now, uh, we're okay. Uh, minsan nga yung mga ibang executives na hindi sila, saka sobrang kapulit ang boss. Saka mahitig kasi ako mag-send ng, <laughs> <laughs> ng profile ng artista ko, kung kaniganino. So sobrang siguro naman, familiar dyan sa, sa style ko na yun. So ayun. But doon ko sinimulan talaga lahat. And very happy ako na uh, itap yung pool of artists ko. Meron sigurong mga ilang-ilang na umalis. Uh, siguro isa, dalawa. Kaya ako, mostly nandiyan sila lahat sa akin. Until now. Simula na nag-umpisa sila. So, very happy ako. Meron pa nga, nawala, biglang bumalik. So, yun ang nakikita ko na siguro yung foundation na binigay kong tiwala sa kung paano ko sila talinato, yun din yung ginabalik nila sa amin. Marami ka naman. So, hindi hindi. Siyempre, ano naman tayo. Uh, Baka sir, kaya naman magkastawa ka. <laughs> <laughs> Meron akong bagong biling sasakyan. Wow. Uh, wow. Dati, pang-aksi-taksi. Uh, yeah. yeah. Ayos, eto yun dati. Dati yung sasakyan ko, binabaha pa yung loob. Uh, ayun, sinasakay ko si James, sila Kelvin. Rob 4 na ngayon, di ba? Inova po, inova na. Uh, <laughs> ayun po. Salamat po, Sir Leo. Congratulations. Ano lang, basta totoo ka lang sa sarili mo. Kung ano yung pinapakita ko ngayon, kung ano yung sinasabi ko sa inyo. Uh, in front uh, of many people, yun ako. Basta totoo lang ako, humble. Uh, kasi wala ka naman dapat yung pagmalaki dito sa industry. Eh, kasi... Paano ka tatagal kung ano, kung magpamalaki ka? At saka itong mga pilanggalingan, itong mga artist, itong mga idol, itong mga managers nila before, like Sir, Sir Ramos David, Direct Manny Valera, Sir Arnold Villafilia, lahat yan, inukuha ko lahat ng mga mga good uh, traits nila, uh, or qualities nila sa pagiging magaling na natin. So ako, um, dito lang ako, uh, kahit paano, makakapuhin ng proyekto, kahit, pa, kahit paano, unti-unti natin tutulungan yung mga artist ang nasa dito. Uh, I think we have time.
Hi, good afternoon. I'm Angel Bueno from Kumoko.com. Um, I have really, really uh, admired uh, you a lot as actors. Um, let me ask you first, uh, Chanel, I've seen you, you know, your journey, your whole journey. When I was also starting uh, blogging about entertainment, per se, I was there at the Artista Academy and followed you all the way to, to who you are right now. You've made a mark also not just in Manila, but uh, also in Bacolo. You, you uh, put up a lot of businesses, I presume. Um, you're leaving a lot in Bacolo. Uh, what are you sacrificing as far as uh, you being here in Manila right now? Yeah. Hello. Hello. Ayan. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Hello, dears. Hello. First, I just want to thank you, no, na um, you've been there also for my journey ever since, yeah. and uh, I appreciate that so much. Oh. I may not be there <laughs> present, no, hindi man tayo nakapagbonding, but I really appreciate deep in my heart. You know, so I'm very grateful. Every everyone's a press, of course. And um, actually, I sacrifice a lot also, uh, especially uh, now since I'm here. Of course, I'm not visibly there to start for. Yes. And actually, you know, a lot of businesses. Not on the pressure, I'm not pressure. Actually, it's my first uh, business venture. Mm -hmm. uh, I also uh, had an interview with uh, Net 25 before. Mm -hmm. And I, I told them it's my first business venture. So kasi I I just don't wanna focus in just one thing. Mm -hmm. Which is yun nga. Um I can do kasi a lot of things. But I need to do some interior design. Mm -hmm. Gusto ko rin, I mean because I don't want to sign your talents na less sa akin. Mm -hmm. I want I want everyone to see and I want to showcase also what I can do. So of course, this is something that I am also very passionate about. In the Garitista, yeah. or mag nag pageant na nga ako, nag Miss World na ako. But now, nag sacrifice ako siguro in terms of, of course, I will I will always set priorities. Like if kaya nga yeah. dito, then I'll be here. If kaya nga ako don, which is kaya nga talaga ako don kasi hindi mo rin may iwan iwan yung business. Yes. Um, basa yon. Um, nag mumotay task ako. I manage. My time accordingly. Kung kaya ko, then go, try kung gawin lahat. Mm -hmm. But you know, I will set my priorities wherever kung saan man ako kakailangan. Can you tell, tell us a little bit more about the business that you have in Bacolod? Okay, so uh, my business is Casa Beauty Lounge Cafe. It's the first concept in the Philippines. Uh, first, it was just a concept, my idea lang. Hindi ko alam na pwede yung uh, beauty salon or beauty lounge tapos may bar and may coffee at the same time or cafe oh dali ko pa yun doon actually pwede tayo doon kuya tayo oh, mag, mag ano tayo mag iko tayo ng bacolod or yeah. mag mascara season pwede pwede ko pwede ko i-host if ever kapag nandun tayo so promise yun ha hindi ako nagbibiro <laughs> so yun um well, this is the first concept na may beauty lounge and cafe at the same time. So, while nagpapa uh, mani, pedi, beauty drips, or facial whatever, oh, wow. pwede rin silang umino sa bar <laughs> and mag-coffee at the same time kung gusto nila. So, I thought first it was just an idea. I didn't know na pwede pala yun. Mm -hmm. But, I really um, took the time to make sure na everything is possible. So, talagang down to the construction, down to the management operations of mga tao. Ako lahat, pati sa mga gamit, ako lahat nag-conceptualize. So if some of you are wondering, but ako na wala for at, at least siguro two years. Uh, because nag, nag try naman ako mag-invest on something na feeling ko may potential. So yun. But now I, I'm, I'm back and I'm willing to also accept the work dito sa help naman ni Kuya Tai. And I'm excited for us and I can see that um, he's a very good person. Because I believe if you're a very good person, then a lot of opportunities will just come your way. And I appreciate ko yun. Because even now, even you, nasabi mo rin, kasama ka sa journey ko. Ako rin, kasama, din, kasama ko din kayo sa journey ko sa, sa industry. And I'm very grateful sa lahat ng experience. It wasn't an easy experience also for me. 
Uh, I don't have my family here, wala naman akong relatives or whatsoever. I do everything on my own. But I'm, I'm happy to say na I can see that si Kuya Tayo is a magiging family ko dito sa Manila. So, All right. yeah. thank you. Alright, uh, so Ty, I, I know this is going to be a lot for you because um, there are a lot of celebrities that are under your team. What would be like uh, your game plan for them? Because of course, not every day. Like every every actor has uh, another program. Uh, of course, hindi lahat siya sabi sabi yung magkakaroon ng project. Uh, what would you do in case na, you know, may isa sa kanila matenga? Tulad ba ni, uh, ano ba si Chanel? Chanel has like a business of her own. Uh, would you be teaching a lot of your artists about saving, about, of course, doing business aside from, of course, the entertainment industry? Actually, hindi ko sila nire-respect sa other opportunities na din. Lalo na pag, uh, when it comes to uh, tulungan nila sarili nila to invest. Mm -hmm. um, even si Jane or si Delvin, lahat yan, ni-encourage mm -hmm. ko sila to invest. Uh -huh. uh, para meron silang um, inatago pag uh, ng savings pag uh, nating ng panahon na hindi na sila talaga nag-artist na mm -hmm. meron silang pag-ubungan. Uh, meron, meron kami parang sinasabing account na nakasave lang yung pera nila. Mm -hmm. Automatic yung kailangan thank you so much sir sir uh, uh, uh may call it chaka of course andrew um, has there been like an, uh, a time in your career that you're really, really down, but you didn't have that enough savings? What were your, I mean, what would your advice be to people that are entering the industry but are not well equipped, uh, financial wise? Uh, what were, would your advice be for them? Um, of course, I experienced that. Um, of course, you should because say it's not. You know, hindi naman siya stable talaga. Mm -hmm. So, for me, ang advice ko sa mga actors, sa mga upcoming actors, and sa mga actors sa sikat nila, mm -hmm. is to save. Uh, they have to save their money. Uh, they have to invest their money wisely. Uh, kasi it's not forever. Uh, it can, you know, it, you can you can lose it like in a single stop. Pwede mo wala yun eh. Uh, kaya dapat parati ka prepared. And uh, the key lesson is coming. Good. So, good. I'm not going to be able to see you. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. I'm seeing the people who are not going to be able Like, because I'm going to be able to 100%, automatically 70% or 80% savings. na yan, walang galaw. And then, 20% going to be able to cash in. So, I'm going to be able to Ever since ganun yung naging practice ko, so ngayon, like, makapag-invest na rin ako ng mga businesses. So, for me, tama si Apollo na ang showbiz is, ano lang siya, uh, season lang. I mean, like, hindi parate may project. So, hindi everyday may project. So, dapat may iba ka rin ko. Especially sa mga nagsisimula. Kasi, sa nagsisimula, expect mo talaga more on investment. Yeah. Yun. And advice ko sa mga papasok ng showbiz, huwag so, nila tignan yung yung PF, yung pera. Kasi at the end of the day, ang mong tatagal yung showbiz is yung, yung craft talaga. Talent. So, kasi oh yeah, kasi yun. Kasi kung yun yung natinigna mo, um, hindi mag-work kapag pera-pera. Alright. So, That'll be all for me. Congratulations again, Paul. Maraming salamat. Thank you so much for that. Uh,